Good morning, students. Uh, today we will cover the chapter four from the first slide that is from the diary of Anne Frank. She born on June in June nineteen twenty nine and she died March nineteen forty five. And this chapter is based on the World War Second. And this is an autobiography of the young girl of the young girl named Anne Frank. In this diary. is gifted by her father on her 13th birthday and think is a jewish girl she is hiding herself during world war second in order to avoid nazis she stayed there for 2 years and she stayed there for 2 years and during that time she has undergone some depression and all the things she her experience she has shared in this diary at this diary she has given a name kitty so in this chapter we will learn about her experiences during those time and will come to know why does she requires to write a diary students now i'll explain the entire story line by line writing in a diary is a really strange experience for someone like me so here the author is saying that writing a diary is a really strange experience for her because she had never written or we can say she, that she didn't have any experience of writing not only because i have never written anything before but also because it seems to me that later on neither i nor anyone else will be interested in the musings of a 13 year old school girl then further she is saying that she had not written anything before but also it seems for her her later neither she nor any verse and not the anybody will take interest in the musings in the thought or in case a reflection of a 13 year old school girl oh well it doesn't matter i feel like writing and i have an even greater need to get all kinds of things off my chest now she is saying i don't bother if anybody likes or not but i feel like writing and i have even greater need to get all kinds of things off my chest students do you know what do people usually do they have friends they talk to each other they share their thoughts but maybe this girl doesn't have any friend that's why she wants to write a diary and she wants to get all kinds of things of her chest what do you mean by things of her chest means she want to relieve herself from keeping the secret in her mind paper has more patience than people i thought of saying on one of those days when i was feeling a little depressed so now she is saying paper has more patience than people why should why is she saying so because people will not be listened what you want to say they don't have patience to hear your all musings but paper has a patience it cannot react it will be quiet till the time you write and why she is saying so because she thought of this saying on one of those days when i was feeling little depressed when she was feeling dip, little depressed and was sitting at home with my chin in my hands and she was sitting alone and depressed at her home bored and listless bored and listless means listless means without any energy wondering whether to stay in or go out and she was staying alone at sitting at alone at home listless boring bored wondering whether she should stay at home or go out with go out with friends or people we can see i finally stayed where i was brooding yes paper does have more patience so finally she decided to she'll stay at home and it was very worrying and she said she is she saying that paper does have more patience rather than people and since i am not planning to let anyone else read this stiff backed notebook grandly referred to as a diary so she has a deep thought about writing a diary and what is she calling it it is a stiff backed notebook and people referred it as a diary unless i should ever find a real friend it 
unless I should find a real friend. Even if I write a diary, I will not let anybody read it unless I will find a real friend. So we can say she doesn't have a real friend. It probably won't make a big difference and it probably make, won't make a big difference. Now I am back to the point that prompted me to keep a diary in the first place. Now she is going to tell us the reason why she is writing the diary. I don't have a friend. Actually she doesn't have friends. That's why she decided to write a diary. Let me put it more clearly. Since no one will believe that a 13 year old is completely alone in the world. And now she is uh, insisting, stressing more in her words that since nobody will believe that a 13 year old old girl is completely alone in the world and I am not and she is not alone. I have loving parents and a 16 year old sister. She has loving parents and a 16 year old sister and there are about 30 people and there are near about 30 people around her. I can call friends to those people she can call friends. I have a family, loving aunts and a good home. She has a family, loving aunts and good home. No, on the surface, I seem to have everything except my one true friend. On the surface, it seems that she, had, she has everything, friends, aunt, good home. But she doesn't have a good and true friend. All I think about when I am with friends is having a good time. I can't bring myself to talk about anything but ordinary everyday things. She is saying that there are friends around me, but I can't share all secrets. And she just talking about everyday ordinary things. While talking these ordinary things, they were not come closer to her. We don't seem to be able to get any closer and that is the problem and while talking with friends ev everyday ordinary things she cannot be closer to her friends and that was the problem maybe it's my fault that we won't that we don't confide in each other and then she accepting that she is maybe this is of her fault that she didn't confide confide means not telling her secret to anybody Confide in each other in any case. That's just how things are. And unfortunately, they are not liable to change. This is why we have started the diary. And unfortunately, they are not liable. Liable means here likely to change. And this is why she has started writing the diary. So that she express her thought on the diary, in the diary. To enhance the image of this long-awaited long friend in my imagination, enhance means to improve the quality. Now she is saying to improve the image of the long-awaited friend. Long-awaited friend means the diary. For now she is considering the diary as her friend in her imagination. I don't want to jot down the facts in this diary the way most people would do. And she is saying now she doesn't want to jot down. Jot down means to write something quickly. The facts in this diary, the way other people do. Generally, the people, they write down the facts about their daily routine in the diary. She doesn't want to do in the same way. But I want the diary to be my friend. But she wants the diary to be her friend. And I'm going to call this, this friend Kitty. And then she decided to name the diary and call it as Kitty. Since no one would understand a word of my stories to Kitty, if I were to plunge right in, plunge means jump. Now she sings. If she, if she start writing straight away, nobody is going to understand, and it would be ineffective. I would better provide a brief sketch of my life, much as I dislike doing so, so that she decided to give. A brief sketch of his her life my father the most adorable father she considered her father as the most adorable father i have ever seen didn't marry my mother until he was 36 
and she was 25 and they got married when his father was 36 and mother was 25 years old my sister margaret was born in frankfurt in germany 1926 and her sister margaret was born in frankfurt in germany in germany 1926 I was born on 12th June 1929 and she born on 12th June 1929. I lived in Frankfurt until I was four and she stayed there in Frankfurt at the age of four. My father immigrated to Holland in 1933 and her father migrated to Holland in 1933. My mother Edith Hollander Frank went with him to Holland in September and her mother went with her father in September. While Margot and I were sent to Arkane to stay with our grandfather and she and her sister Margot, they were sent to Aachen. Aachen is a place in Germany, a town in Germany to this where they stay with their grandmother. Margot went to Holland in December and I followed in February. Then Margaret went to Holland in December and afterwards she followed her in month of February. When I was plunked down on the table as a birthday present for Margaret. So why did she go in the month of February? Because she was a she was just like a birthday gift for her sister at is as it was a surprise visit. I started right away at the Montessori Nursery School. As soon as she reached to Holland, she went to Montessori, Montessori Nursery School. I stayed there until I was six and she stayed there. She studied there till six years, at which time I started in the first form. And afterwards, she started first form. First form means a first standard or first grade. In the sixth form, my teacher was Mrs. Cupris and the sixth standard, her teacher was Mrs. Cupris, the handmistress. At the end of the year, we were both in tears as we said a heartbreaking farewell. And at the end of the year, they both were in tears. They both were crying as they were very close to each other and they were loved to each other. And there, and that's why there was a heartbreaking farewell. In the summer of 1941, grandma fell ill and had to have an operation. So in the month of summer, in, in summer, during summer, her grandmother fell ill and she had gone under an operation. So my birthday passed with little celebration and due to this, her birthday was celebrated with very little celebration. Almost there was no any grand, grand celebration. Grandma died in January 1942. No one knows how often I think of her and I still love her. Then her grandmother di died. In January 1942 and she loves her grandmother a lot and still she loves her. This birthday celebration in 1942 was intended to make up for the other and this time in 1942 she celebrated her birthday for other people and grandma's candle was lit along with the rest and when on her next birthday she lit a candle for her grandmother along with her other family members. The four of us are still doing well and that brings me to the present date of 20 June 1942 and the solemn dedication of my diary. And the four of us, who are those four? She, her sister, her father and her mother, they were still doing good and that's bring her to start and writing a diary. And which did she start writing a diary? 20th June 1942. And for the and the Solomon Solomon dedication of my diary, and this for the sincere dedication to her diary.